so long time you never have it again Now it moves so far, you just the arms with a pick of the face Then you make it a ball and I need you, I want to Hello, welcome to Neural Nikki in real life. No. I'll show you clips of pictures of my real actual life. I can't stop looking at my bedroom. I'm in the middle of a bedroom remodel right now and it's gonna take a little bit of time. I did do a video on it, but it won't go up for probably like a month or so because it's it's not finished yet, but I'm fucking loving it so far. Anyway, welcome back. I have a lot of catching up to do with you guys. So this past month has been so freaking busy like call me Gary cuz I've been busy. Wow, that was just starting off with a real cringe fest Yeah, so it's been really busy. I've mostly been shooting and editing Constantly we're stockpiled on sticky show videos uh, Stockpiled on should they don't tell you videos. I've been shooting a lot of JK news and hey bitch and um, It's all just been super exciting. I've been like in a new upswing of creativity. Hopefully, maybe you could tell from the new videos that have been coming out. Also, the bedroom remodel, maybe you could tell. I don't know. I don't know if you could tell about my bedroom, but I've been feeling creative. Anyway, going and editing this, I really, I realized that I only pulled out my vlog camera when I was doing just anything other than work. So it's gonna look like I'm like a social party animal, but uh, you know the truth. Let's start with date night. <laughs> On date night 2019. What's up? It's time. Um, so Steve has a gift certificate to this movie theater called iPic, where they have like these crazy mother seats that like lounge out. They're like lazy boys. Everybody's like in a lazy boy. And they have like servers that come around and give you drinks and stuff. And there's like a fancy bar downstairs. And we're here seeing Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Yeah, Nikki's favorite director is Quentin Tarantino. Yeah, I got to wear my new Nikki leopard. Looks I got. Um, a oh. Steve outfit. But and I got a Nikki outfit. Yeah, he got a Nikki outfit. No, he just gotta get you dressed to your pants. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. true. Yeah. I'll get that. I'm gonna be hot this time next month, but you'll see. You're hot now. No, but I'm gonna be extra hot. Okay, I can't wait. Wait, wait, wait. Like, wait. look at this. Look. Ooh. I don't really want to be a downer because Quentin Tarantino is legit my favorite director. But I didn't really like that movie. It got a really good score on Rotten Tomatoes, so maybe, I mean, maybe I'm wrong, but I just felt like the acting was amazing. The cinematography, fantastic, but I just felt like the, the story was missing a little bit for me. I really felt like I was waiting for things to happen, and then by the time something happened, the movie was over. No, 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 no. let's move on. We did a photo shoot with JK News. So JK News, I don't know if you know this, but they restarted their Instagram, so we had to take some like cute little pictures to get it started again. It was really fun. It was actually just an excuse to bond with everybody. We are here at the Huntington Library Botanical Gardens. Now it looks like I'm talking to myself. I was trying to show you. <laughs> she, no. She's talking to we herself. We are here. I swear I'm not alone. What an idiot. She's alone. alone. <laughs> so she's all alone at Huntington Gardens. What a weirdo. Why are we here, you ask? For Huntington Library. Well, guess what? We are here for a JK News photo shoot. Also, Steve has never been to the Huntington Library, which I'm shocked about because you've lived in LA for like 13 Longer years. Than you. Yeah. And this is kind of a staple in LA. It's kind of like one of those places that. It's like a must-see location. Yeah, I don't think that there's a lot of drinking here or partying or fun shit. And everyone knows I'm That's the party true. guy. I'm yeah, party you're a party animal. That's uh, what they call you. Everybody knows I'm I'm the go-to guy for all party things. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this was never on my list. You know what I mean? <laughs> I see. Yeah. No, that's not raging enough. Well, that doesn't mean it didn't bring me a flask. You know what I'm saying? That doesn't mean I'm not gonna get fucked up. You know? We can play some techno music while we're here. We can light this place up. You wanna do that? <laughs> yeah, I'm done. You wanna light it up? We get thrown out of here like in 15 minutes. <laughs> yeah. Like, why did you start drinking at 10 a.m. and this fucking and Huntington Library boom and techno music. <laughs> we brought the party, you're welcome. But yeah, it's a really, really beautiful place full of flowers. Um, if you like flowers and beautiful places, you'd probably be into it. I personally get bored really quickly <laughs> of you know like flower is? gardens, but it's really pretty. And look it's at great this, for dude. pictures. I know. It's 10 a.m. It's 10 a.m. and the lot oh. is completely full. There's like crowds of people walking It's like in. we're going to the flower zoo. <laughs> like look it's at like this. It's the Disneyland of flowers. It yeah. looks literally like we're going to the flower zoo. Yeah, we are. Anyway, I'm gonna show you a little of the inside of this place. So 
Get your balls ready. <laughs> Wait to fucking amp them up get for it. Get your fucking you're balls like, hey, ready. Guys, get ready for some underwhelming flower shit. <laughs> and then you're like, okay, I'm gonna show you no, this it's, day. No, put it to music. It's gonna be a party in here. <laughs> oh, that's true. Um, it's gonna be such a party. You always do make it more of a party. Yeah. Yeah. That's so what you gotta do on social media. Make your life look more glamorous than it really is. Can you cut to me a bunch during that flower montage? Just keep cutting to yeah, me you dance. As well? You gotta dance. Do some okay, moves. yeah, I'll, yeah I'm, do not. Some moves. Okay. I'm not. Here we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, coming in. Coming in. Yeah. Flex. I just wanna win. Yeah. L.A. B.B. Who we running with? Yeah. Two, two, three, three. I'm on ten again. Yeah. State your name. Big Ben dope on flame. I just switched the lanes. Damn, he did it again. I just flipped the pain. Stripping and dipping in base. Slab on everything. Swimming, you sinking away. Cause I got big racks coming. I put my low racks on it. I ain't skip past losses. I had to get back off. Wow, what a party. Hello. We are about to go get all the deals and go shopping. Are you excited? Yeah. Also, this is my first time in Tiff's car. She has a Tesla because she's fucking fancy. And this <laughs> looks so cool. Look at Thank this. You. I mean, it's like a robot car. Is this a skylight? What is this? Oh, it's like a it's it's a it's a glass roof. What? This is the future. This Look what so I cool. did. I'm so proud of my work. Yeah. I did this myself. What did all, you do? All of this that's white right here? Yeah. I, I did it. You designed it? I no, I actually put it together. So what? it came like this. Oh. With this like cheapy, shiny, plastic black stuff. Yeah. But I bought the decal to wrap it myself. Oh, so shit. You can see how crappy of a job I did when you look at the edges Oh, I here. never would have been able to tell. Like, it yeah. looks legit. It looks like you bought it like this. Did you do it here, too? No, so I wanted it to match this. Oh, and, it looks and perfect. The sides. Yeah, and then the seats. And it looks I like also, it's supposed to be like that. Thank you. I worked so hard. My neck was like dead after doing this oh for, God. I don't know. I should have timed myself. I didn't time myself. But I also <laughs> did the, <laughs> She should have timed herself. That's what we all yeah, wanted. But I also did the red tees. Cute. And then yeah. on the wheels and then on the cameras. Oh my God. I did it all myself. Wow, I'm so proud of you. I have such talented friends. A lot of uh, the JK crew live on a different side of town than I do. But Gina's party was at an Airbnb that she rented on on my side of town. So Tiff actually came over a couple hours earlier and we went to go check out the Urban Outfitters surplus store. If you've never been to an Urban Outfitters surplus store, it's basically like the entire sales section in a giant store. Like everything that they have on sale that hasn't sold out of the locations around it ends up in this store. Some of the items are marked down like 90%. Like you could find things that started off at $80 that are now $10. It is pretty insane. I'll leave you with this little fashion show I did because it's really just deal porn for all of you thrifty people out there. Look at these deals. Oh my god. Deals, deals, deals. Deals, 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 more deals. <laughs> Too aggressive. Let's get out. Okay, we got our shopping done and now we're on our way to Gina's 30th birthday party when she's having a funeral themed birthday because it's the death of her youth. So look at us. Yes. Oh my god, look at this hat. This is amazing. I love this whole look. I am living for it, Queen. This looks so good with the hair color too. Hold on, hold on. Oh my god. Oh shit. Are you holding? You better be holding. That's my friend. That's my friend. My freaking friend. Boom. Oh, wow. Done. And the Apple Watch really makes it. <laughs> no, no, no. Now, boom. Oh, there you go. Ooh. And then there's Steve. <laughs> How who's, long Who's it? actually How feeling like he's waiting for a Two hours hour. for that. Hey, hey, was hey, it worth hey. It? hey. Yes. You know what? God. I don't know. You tell us. Was it I've been worth sitting it? ready since seven. You said seven. Well, they yeah. seven. I've been ready since seven. I don't it recall. Is. I don't it recall. Is. I plead the fifth. It is. What time is it? I don't recall. It's Look seven. It's seven. Look at that. It's nine twenty-five. It's seven she after nine twenty. Okay. Mom and dad are. I'm not a mom and dad. I'm just venting. I find it to be very healthy. She went all out on this party. I was so motherfucking impressed.
holy balls, what a great party. I've been to weddings that were less impressive than this. Girl did it right. She even made a video of this whole event and it's so cute and edited so well. You should definitely check it out. I'll leave a link in the description because it's so cute. But yeah, happy birthday, Jita. This is super late. This was like a few weeks ago, but happy birthday, Jita. <laughs> then I got invited to a weed museum with NYX Cosmetics. And yeah, I had no idea what a weed museum was, but I just knew I couldn't say no to it. I'm going to this party right now. It's um, a NYX Cosmetics party and we're going to a weed museum. I am personally not a weed smoker, it gives me anxiety. However, I do enjoy me some CBD oil, okay? Calm that anxiety. But um, look what they sent, this is so cute. This presentation, this is a, like a little stash box that actually locks and it's made of metal and, 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 and it has makeup in there that's made from cannabis. That is so darn cute, the cannabis pin. I'm just such a sucker for presentation because this is actually something I can reuse again. Not like uh, a lot of companies that send you like a bunch of promo material and cardboard boxes and there's like so much plastic and packaging. This is like legit something I will actually use again and store like little photos and cute shit in. Ah, God, you really got me, Nick. Also, check the Uta today. Oh, dang. Yeah, so I'm gonna go, they sent a lift code and I'm gonna go pick up my friend Jess Lazama. Exotic Jess. First, we're gonna go to Gracias Madre where they're gonna have drinks and food, which I'm so stoked on because if you don't know, uh, Gracias Madre is actually a vegan Mexican restaurant and it's food that even though it's vegan, it's like food that you wouldn't, you couldn't tell is vegan. Like I brought so many people there that are omnivore people. They eat full on meat. They're full on meat eaters. Like Steve loves Mexican food and he loves Gracias Madre. So I'm so stoked. Plus they have really good drinks there. I'm excited to see what they got going. Um, and yeah, and then we're gonna check out a weed museum. Let's get the hell out of here. I belong, I belong to you. I belong, I belong to you. Do just what you want. You're the one I trust. So we just finished up at Gracias Madre where they served us a lot of alcohol and uh, really good food. But we now- a lot of alcohol and I went like this. It was honestly like two drinks, but we're <laughs> such lightweights that we're like, we're drunk, we're drunk. But they offered lift codes, so we were not driving. Yeah, okay, we're good. We're allowed totally to do this. Responsible. And then we're getting on a bus right now to go to the Weed Museum. And it has a stripper pole. It has a stripper pole. <laughs> Nikki's oh my God. Here, so. We're all stripping. <laughs> I'm naked already. <laughs> We were being okay. illegal. <laughs> no, you're being illegal. Stop it. Okay, legit. I did not realize how tipsy I was until I edited this vlog. Holy balls. I now know what Steve feels like when it's my birthday party. Yep, I'll just leave this here. We're sober. We're totally we sober. Are sober. You know, I know how to count to 10 in German. Do it. Einstein, die, vier, fünf, sechs, sieben, Oh my god. <laughs> Who are you? My Who friend knows German by I'm bilingual, so I'm bilingual. She looks so German. Take me to Amsterdam and it'll be Yes, fun. I love Amsterdam. Like, oh my god, why? Excuse me. Why would you do this? Do you want me to fuck it up? You embarrassed me. Is this guy bothering yes, you? Yes, yes. Is guy bothering you? Ran into that. You know what? You know what I have to say to that? Me, sir. You know what I say to that? Yes. Look at this, look at this, check this out. Oh my god. I did it. Do it again. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucked up. Wow. Don't mess with my girl. Don't fuck with me. I am impressed that I actually remembered to take out my vlog camera during this time. Vlog some of the weed museum. <laughs> all the weed. Okay. What's crazy 
to me is how weed has always been portrayed as this like evil thing growing up, like in all the dare programs, and I always thought it was like this crazy drug that people were gonna pressure you to, to take, and like you try to say no and then shove it down your throat or whatever. Uh, but now it's like not only is it accepted more in society, it's legal, and they're finding more and more medicinal purposes for it, which I think is awesome because even as a person who does not indulge in the marijuana. I'm really happy for um, the people that do use it recreationally because it's not worse than alcohol. So yeah, what a win. Is this political? Anyway, uh, that's what's been going on in my life. There's still a lot more that I wanna catch up with you on. Maybe when it slows down a little bit, I can catch my breath and edit some videos and finish my bedroom remodel and uh, some other things. It's a party, life's a party. And you've seen it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. Subscribe so you don't miss any of this. And I will see you next time. Bye! Bye.